So Remo Tech kindly sent me this Osbot Me and I think the reason they added the word me on it is because you add your own uh, cell phone to this AI power selfie mount which will track you so you could do very interesting uh, video featuring stuff actually. So um, I'm sure many of you actually already heard the product range called Osbot because a lot of famous YouTubers have already reviewed the product. Uh, related to Osbot and I think it's really cool actually so I look forward to uh, review this so the main unique selling point about this is that it's the tracking that I just talked about early on and you don't really need an app in other words um, it has this sort of a clever AI chip uh, that enables you to track you uh, without uh, downloading any exclusive app now the quick lock system is quite interesting. I actually saw some of the clips where someone will actually do this speak to the hand gesture where um, it will actually stop uh, tracking you. So I really look forward to try that out. And it has this brushless um, motor. In other words, we'll, we'll be expecting a very smooth sort of rotating uh, without a sound, ho hopefully a motor that tracks you. So that'll be really cool. Um, now the highlight of the Osmo Me is that it's a foldable design. That's why you can see that it's very compact, the package itself. And it has the quarter interface, which I don't know what it means, but I think it's like a universal mounting system that many of the camera experts out there will know exactly what it means. It has the universal joint and rotatable phone holder as well. Now, something I really want to find out is whether my Z Fold 3 will be able to mount on it because the weight limit is actually, the cut line is the weight of the Z Fold 3, but I'm not sure whether the thickness will be uh, suitable. But anyhow, let's try that out and see how it goes. But it, rest of the spec, I'll put, put it down on the video description below. But enough said, let's get into the unboxing. So here it goes. Cool. So the moment of truth, hey? Eh? Nice. Let me catch you. <laughs> That's a nice phrase. Yeah, the booklet of the um, user manual. Um, so I'll just quickly flick through that, which actually has various languages, I believe. And that's very useful indeed. Great. Now, this is the actual case. That's very neat, isn't it? So that you could actually carry it around with you all the time. Nice quality. Well done. It actually has the Offspot logo on it as well. Okay, so if we were to open it up, Voila! Wow, so what do we have here? On the first instance, we got the charging cable here. Um, that is a USB-C, as you can see. And I believe this is like uh, something to do with the mount. It's a plastic um, chip that doesn't seem to have any sticky parts. This is the tripod that comes along with it. And um, okay, that's, that's quite nice. And lastly, and finally, we got the Obsport Me with me. And wow, that's really smooth, like what they said. Um, but before we get into the unfolding of this whole thing, this kind of reminds me of that character from uh, Despicable Me, doesn't it? It's quite cute. Anyhow, uh, that's the um, phone mount that we could play er later on. So I presume it actually goes this way, does it? Okay. Um, and then this is where you actually put your tripod on or any of your universal mount because that's quite um, common. That will basically track you down and that will be the actual phone mount. And let's see if my Z Fold 3 will be able to get into it. So the moment of truth, here it goes. Voila! <laughs> we got the Z Fold 3 mount it up. So this chip early on that I highlighted is mainly for tightening up this joint here. So I presume this is very handy tool that you should carry it with you all the time because you need to adjust um, after you rotate your phone. Um, the other thing I failed to actually let you know is that there's where you charge your USB-C 
and then uh, you're all good to go. So here we have it people, it's nicely set up with my Z Fold 3 on a selfie mode, portrait mode and when initially I turned it on it was showing this green um, ring light around it and I thought that meant that I need to connect it to my um, smartphone, my Z Fold 3 but it didn't show anything on my Bluetooth connection and I realized later on what that green uh, ring light meant is that it's on a station mode, it doesn't move. Now it's actually on a blue light mode which means that it actually tracks me so let me actually show you this actually moves almost up to 180 degrees and it's now following me and that's really cool and the way how you could stop the gesture is that you put your hands up like that and that should really stop it but now you can see is that my gesture control is also set up on my Samsung phone so now my Samsung uh, Z Fold 3 is starting to record my video, um, starting my video recording in other words and um, there's a bit of a conflict there but obviously I could actually change my gesture control on my Samsung phone but again if I want to resume the uh, tracking that's all I need to do and then now you can see that it's changed to blue light and it just follows me like as if someone greatly adores me like a sunflower that tracks the lovely um, sunlight that's how it actually tracks me so that's really interesting and um, yeah it's a really nice feature and obviously I cannot hear any noise whatsoever of the motor sound at all so that's exactly what they said on the tin and um, it's it's a really nice feeling kind of odd actually because yeah it's a new technology I, it's something that is new to me that I find it very very interesting. Now I also need to find out from the Samsung uh, gesture control point of view whether um, how to turn off the recording but this one is really easy to use and it's so amazing <laughs> that it's still tracking me but if I start to get annoyed I could always do that and that will actually make the green light on to stop. Yeah see now it's stop and I'm back on my desk and I could talk to you guys so there you go. So what can I say prior to receiving the Osbot Me uh, I received a document PDF describing how this works and, and the uh, selling points and etc and I was a bit skeptical whether it's actually going to perform as how it was described but it turns out it it actually functions exactly how it's described. The motion of this motor is extremely smooth and there's zero sound. So I don't know how they came up with this brilliant technology, which is really good. Uh, the other thing is the universal mount. So this will become really handy. And it also, like quite rightly says, it accepts my Z Fold 3. Uh, onto its mount as well so it is pretty much if you can mount in your Z Fold 3 into this mount you can pretty much mount in most of the phone that is available um, I don't think tablet will be a suitable thing because it has the weight limit of uh, 270 gram I think plus and minus and that's actually the weight of the Z Fold 3 but anyhow um, one thing if I have to be very picky on is that it seems to have a really good camera attached to this good so it's a bit of a shame that this cannot record it but I would like to know what sort of quality it produced but then again you actually mount your own uh, smartphone onto it so why do you need that any anyway but then again um, if you detach your smartphone can't it still be used as a recording uh, whether it has a recording function onto this camera that would be something quite interesting if there will be an upgrade but then again when you actually set this one up it's you don't need to connect it to your Bluetooth um, it, when you turn it on it's straight just good to go so I don't I don't think the word setup applies in a case for the Offspot Me which is a really clever device I'm, I'm still trying to get a hang of what this can do but I'm sure it will become very handy overall and it's a brilliant technology uh, produced by Remo Tech. So I just want to thank Remo Tech to give me this opportunity to review this fantastic device. But anyhow, I hope this video helped you understand about what this uh, Remo Tech's um, Oswald Me is about. But if you have any queries, please do comment below and I'll be more than happy to come back to you. So thank you very much for watching this video. This is LJP Tech. All the best. Bye-bye.